After leaving Colorado, Oleg and I decided to skip on down to Taos, New Mexico, a place I have been dying to visit for years. Known for its historic adobe buildings, most notably Taos Pueblo, this northern New Mexico town has a vibrancy that is truly unparalleled. Unfortunately, we only had a couple of hours to walk the artistic streets, but you know that we always make time to hit that thrift. Oh, let's say the price? I don't know. Wintage. My tea, I have the Rio Grande, I have my love. What else do I have to ask for? It's beautiful. Campground. Campground. It's a perfect campground. Let's go see. Really? It's just it's an excursion. Seven dollars. Seven dollar hairs, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Something to dance over. That was yeah, that was wild. Do you have the skill it takes? I'm kidding me. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, the knot just holds it up. Now you gotta split it with that amazing core and bicep strength. No, this is I mean if you do it they give you hundred dollars. Two hundred. Two hundred. Okay, all right. Here we go. Here we go, ready? Two minutes. Two minutes? Right. <laughs> you know what? I forfeit. Brooklyn. Yeah, yeah, New York. yeah. Where? Brooklyn. We are in beautiful Santa Fe, New Mexico. One of my favorite cities of all time. sunny, enchanting Santa Fe, New Mexico. Truly one of my favorite cities of all time. I've been here once before in 2020, so it was kind of partially shut down. Now everything is open, thriving, and so vibrant. There's something about this place that just makes me feel like anything is truly possible, and that is what I love about it. It's endlessly giving, truly amazing. Today we're just gonna kind of bop around, have some fun, see the sights, maybe do some shopping. Guilty as charged, enjoy. Burrito. Breakfast burrito. Ye to the ha, baby. Spent the better part of the day in New Mexico State Capitol. I absolutely never get sick of this place. And with its population of almost 90,000 residents, Santa Fe offers the feel of a bustling downtown with enough space to allow your mind to still freely roam. I could truly spend a lifetime here, but the road was calling and we had to go, baby. These sights are wonderful, but there's nothing more magical 
in that little car, powering through with that mattress on top. Go, baby, and go! And the spring box, spring box on top. And the spring box on top. Go, baby, go! For the next two nights, we actually had the incredibly great fortune of spending time with one of our best friends from New York's grandparents. Follow me on this one. It was so nice to sleep in a bed, be well-fed, and share conversations with two truly amazing people. I'm forever thankful for the wonderful people we meet along the way and the memories created from these very chance encounters. Well, guys, the cheapest gas on the trip, 306. Where are we? New Jersey. <laughs> We're in New Mexico, and it sounds like somebody has a parrot. Murphy Express, God bless. We are on the way to White Sands National Park, which is very exciting, because we should be avoiding whatever that catastrophe is. It's gonna be just lovely. Turn it on. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> mama, I'm sorry, but we gotta go. Bye, Mama. 
Bye, Mama. Bye, Mama. Don't cry. Stop! Don't make me. So, we set out with the strongest of intentions to visit the famous Carlsbad Caverns, only to realize we had made a very grave mistake. Anna, what happened? What happened to the caves? I'm really devastated. We what? drove all this way. It might have still been on our route. That's and it was $150 fine. per person, right? $150 per person. And, and we bailed out. out. We bailed. No. Um, so they stopped selling tickets apparently at 2.15 p.m. We arrived at 2.58 p.m. And that's fine. We have another thunderstorm looming right over us. So we're trying to That one's not that it. bad. It's not that bad. But we're trying to escape it. I mean, you can't even see it right now. We're heading to Tejas. Texas, baby. Yes. And hopefully that will invite us with open arms. Let's go, baby. Yeehaw.